What's up everybody? Main Fly Guys here with another tutorial. This is my most successful pattern that I have ever created. First we're gonna, this is a curved, I think it's a fire hole 317, size 16. This is UTC uh, 70, fluorescent green. It's a really cool color. Um, so this is my turkey tail feather and I'm gonna tell you where to take the fibers from on this feather. So to start, we're gonna take the tail feather. If you're looking at the back side, you'll notice that the quill is white on the back side. So if you're looking at it, you're gonna to wanna to take it on the left um, on the left side. These fibers are just a little more pointed. They make better tails. And you're gonna to wanna to grab, I don't know, somewhere between four and six fibers and then you're gonna come down way into the hook, way into the bend. And you want the tail to be about half the length of the body, just kind of a short little tail. So I'm way down into the hook and there's my little tail. Next, this is Mirage Flashaboo. Here it is, Mirage Flashaboo. I am just going to do one turn, tie that in, and then from the very tip top of the turkey tail, so either side, the right or the left, you're just going to grab one individual fiber. And I'm going to tie the tip down, and then I'm going to do touching wraps moving forward to about two eye lengths behind the eye. That looks about good. Then I'm going to take the individual fiber and I'm going to whoops, whoops, So I'm going to take the individual fiber and be very careful because it is quite fragile. And I'm going to do what's called open wraps forward. I like to make them wider than the flashaboo, um, but not crazy wide. Try to do like six, five or six segments. Once you get it to the top. I just do a couple securing wraps. Then we'll take the flashaboo and you're going to go in between the turkey wraps. So you get this green, shiny kind of looking body. How's that look? Tough to tell, but it's pretty shiny. You really can't tell in the video. So now I'm going to work back. All right. And I have taken several from the, if you're looking at the white again, on the left side, I've taken probably six fibers, seven fibers um, to make two sets of wings. So 14 fibers total. And you don't need to be it doesn't need to be a salmon fly. This is not going to be a pure match. So here's what they kind of look like. I've paired them up very, very, um, you know, casually. And you're going to want to make a little wing that doesn't go past the tail. So you want it to be right about there. It's going to be a short little, short little wing. And I just do two. Come out front. Wrap it up. That's fine by me. Again, it does not need to be pretty by any means. Once you have your wing, there that is that's see like that's what I that's what I like. I like like a very bushy wing. I'm gonna go to the base of the turkey feather. And you see all this fluffy stuff? I'm gonna take you know just a little bit. Just a little bit, and I'm gonna make a dubbing ball. 
So it's very fluffy. So I'm going to go through it a few times. There we go. You can um, brush this out and it will make a very buggy body, but I don't want it for this one. Um, I'm just going to keep it pretty clean. All right, and then we're going to come in with a partridge shoulder feather. There we go. And I'm going to make my collar using a partridge. Unfortunately, turkey don't really have a, a good soft hackle feather on their body. So I go with partridge. And I'm going to start making my wraps. And right there looks good. I'm going to go one, two over. And then I'm going to start building my head, pulling everything back. I don't like to make my heads on these soft tackles incredibly large. I want them to be quite small. Look at that. Oof, I cannot wait to get this in the water. All right, and then I'm just gonna whip finish my head. And you can add a little lacquer or super glue or UV, whatever, to make the head, you know, better. But um, there it is. There is the Turkey Tom. Just a beautiful pattern that uh, fish just love this for whatever reason. They really, really like it. And I think it's just, you know, it's just a little buggy pattern. Um, but that is the Turkey Tom. Mostly turkey. Unfortunately, the collar is, is partridge, but, you know. So, thank you for watching. And our next fly will be a turkey dry fly. And I'm going to try something different that I usually don't do. So, you'll probably want to tune in to watch me mess up on that one now. So, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe to our YouTube page and check us out on Instagram for more uh, fishy content. So, we'll see you next time.